And I'm back. Let's explore this room. Had a nice meal. Um, I feel way better now. Okay. Where was I? Right, I just entered this module from the outside to this crack in the window. And I'm about to be filled with lore and I cannot wait. Insert probe tracking module projection stone. Mallow says, imagine Privet. The probe tracking module would be the first to know the coordinates of the eye of the universe. You'll be the first to see them. I am honored and terrified. You won't ask the Oberol probe cannon to use so much power that it breaks, will you? Fret not, my nervous friend. We only need to fire the probe once anyway. So who minds if it compromises the Oberol probe cannon's structural integrity slightly? I would mind, Mallow. I would mind, because we won't be capable of receiving our probe's data if the probe tracking module is destroyed. Are we in the probe tracking module right now? What is this shadow? Is it just this, us orbiting the planet and sometimes the planet occludes the sun or something? I bet it is, but... Right, we have this thing. What, what does it say? Control module projection stone. Uh, okay, let's try that here. This is where I was. Yeah, this is the module that's in... Yeah, this is the... Yeah, look. Oh! It actually... Okay, so it's confirmed that it's actually in real time. It's not like a video being played. This is actually what's happening in the solar system right now. Because I activated this one. I remember it. And I'm seeing it from inside here now. It's basically like I'm teleported. But I cannot move very far. Because this happens. Let me grab that. Uh, put it there. Take this. Probe, tr probe tracking module. Ooh. This is the last module that's missing. What the hell is going on here? I see lightning everywhere. What is that? Wait, wait, wait. What the hell is that? I wish I could take out my signal scope. <gasps> Lightning! I get it. I think I get it. Wait, let me think. Okay. I get it. I get it. Wait. Wait for it. Wait, I'm gonna go on this side. So you can see. You ready? Come on. Whoops. Don't fall down. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Uh, one sec. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Uh, back to the ship. Oh no, I didn't read everything yet, did I? Uh, oh my god, this is so crazy, I'm really close to the planet. Where's my ship? This way, this way, this way. Go! Okay, we have plenty of time. Is that 60 seconds, right? Or is it 30? Here we go. In. Up. Oh, thank god. Okay, let me see if I can show you from here. What I w I'm being very secretive, I know. But wait. It's gonna be worth it. Ah! Come on, get up here! Ah, ah, there we go. Okay, will you cooperate with me now? Look at the... There! You see that?
There's lightning on this planet. I've seen it ever since I started playing this game. And I'm seeing lightning in that projection of the, there of the probe tracking module. So it's I bet it's on Giant's Deep somewhere. It fell off, remember? There was one missing. It fell Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. <gasps> I'm locked out. It's on the other side. I have to open it from the other side. Okay. I, okay, 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 okay. But let me go back. Sorry, there's so many things I want to do right now. I'm very overwhelmed. Here. I think this was it. I just want to go back in here, see if I missed some reading. Is this not the, the cracked one? I don't think... No. It's the other one. Oh my god. The perspective is so crazy when the planet is just behind us like this. Oh! Didn't mean to do that. There it is. I see the crack. Go, 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 go. If you remember the... The gold animation. When the cannon broke apart, one of the modules fell down. Right? Into Giant's Deep. Okay, we saw this. We saw that we saw those projections. Let me try the probe tracking module here. I don't remember if I did that. Okay, we did that. Uh, let me try the other one. Oh, this one is new. Avon says, Mallow, my wait. We have seen this. Okay, why are we... Why can I... Why is it, what does it say untranslated then? Weird. Um... Is there a secret on this side of the broken... Doesn't look like it. Um, let's get back out. Back to the ship. Nope, not back to the ship. Back to... Yeah, let's go back to the ship. I think we did everything here, right? Oh god, oh god, this is so crazy. Feels like I'm a... Uh, like 15 meters away from the planet. Forward, down, forward, down. Orbital probe cannon. Control module, launch module, probe tracking module. Missing. The broken remains of a Nomai space station in orbit around Giant's Deep. There are three access ways branching off from the central hub area. The orbital probe cannon was created to find the precise location of the eye of the universe. The precise location. The Nomai pushed the orbital probe cannon above its maximum power setting to create the greatest chance of finding the eye of the universe. Let me actually read this uh, after the loop, because I just quickly want to go to... I want to go into Giant's Deep real quick, while we still have time. Okay, here, here goes nothing. Oh, I can't lock on anymore. Shit. Ho! Oh, whoa, 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 what the shit? Holy fuck. Oh my god, there's a bigger one here. Wow. Oh my god, it's so dark. What's happening? Oh, the sun exploding. <laughs> this is like a fucking crazy shit. Look at this place. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm just cruising through, I'm drifting through these tornadoes. Here comes the here comes the sun. Okay. That was a very brief exploration of Giant's Deep. Not much happened. <laughs> We're going to go back. But first I want to read the 
I want to read the ship computer. That planet looks batshit insane. When I thought I saw everything, the game is like, no. And I get slapped across the face with a black, dark, volcanic, no, not volcanic, tornadic, tornado filled moon, planet. My god, I cannot speak. Slate. You have nothing new to say. You're right, it is a powerful death trap. Oh, man. So much to do, so much to explore. I had another thought I wanted to get off my chest that I didn't find time for. Uh, let me open... Uh, no, not like this. Like that. So this is where I was reading. Now, a thing that puzzled me... And actually, before I say it out loud, maybe I should just read this in case my, my uh, question gets answered. So let, let's just read. The control module. The control module recently received a request from the Ash Twin project to launch the probe. The cannon was aligned with a randomly selected probe trajectory. The probe was successfully launched, but the cannon's structural integrity was compromised in the process. Damage is detected in multiple modules. You have the launch module. And the launch module is badly damaged, but its projection pool is still intact. A Nomai named Mallow argued that it wouldn't matter if the cannon's structural integrity was compromised, since they only needed to fire the probe once. A Nomai named Privet countered that they wouldn't be capable of receiving the probe's data if the probe tracking module was destroyed. One of the orbital probe cannon's three modules. The probe tracking module is receiving data from the launched probe. Any Nomai aboard the probe tracking module would be the first to see the coordinates of the eye of the universe. So Privet was in the probe tracking module. Oh no. The probe tracking module was the one that broke off from the cannon and fell into Giant's Deep, right? At least according to the theory. While Privet was inside, now I'm curious if I, in that projection, if I would see a corpse in there. Maybe Privet died from that. Hmm. I know my computer reports the probe tracking module as missing. Yeah. I saw the probe tracking module through a Nomai projection pool. It looks like the module is underwater? I could see purple electricity outside the viewport. Okay, yeah, I guess that makes sense. If it fell into Giant's Deep, obviously it would hit the water because it's like what it seems like a giant water planet, right? I just thought the lightning I saw was something that happened in the gas clouds. Maybe it is. Maybe this is a different lighting. A lightning. Elect purple electricity. Hmm. Then we have the construction yard. The Nomai built the orbital probe cannon at the construction yard on Giant's Deep. Uh, so what I was wondering, while I was reading some of the lore in the, I believe, control module, is that why would you randomly align the cannon? That doesn't make any sense to me. And they only need to fire it once. That's what makes even less sense to me. What, you're just gonna randomly align it and fire it in some direction? Doesn't matter if the cannon breaks apart? How does that make sense? Hmm. But why was the cannon given instructions from Ash Twin? Why did what, what, what does Ash Twin have to do with any of this? What does Ash Twin have to do with the cannon? Isn't the cannon just something they built to locate the eye? I don't know how that would work. Like, I'm just gonna shoot a probe randomly in some direction, hope it encounters it? 
Um, so what does that have to do with the Ash Twin Project? Because that was built, as far as I understand, in order to survive a supernova that was coming. They built a bunker, right? go back. I also really want to go back to the Hourglass Twins because, oh, the thing is, all of this is connected. I'm, 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 I'm getting it now. The, the mind map in the rumor mode, everything is connected to each other. It's one big mystery where you get a little piece of the puzzle when you go somewhere and read something or discover something. I wonder if this game ends. Like, is, is there an ending? Is there a, hey, here are the credits? You know what I mean? I guess there is. I'm curious to see how that will end. How will all of this end? I also want to go to the interloper. I also want to explore this. The satellite. The one that took the pictures we saw on Timber Hearth. The deep space satellite or something. Okay, Giant's Deep. I can't log on. God damn it. Not again. Fuck. Okay. We're doing it live. Where's Giant's Deep? Where's Giant's Deep? Uh, is it behind the sun? No, it should be there. And there's that moon. Kind of, I try. Last time I, I tried sending a probe into it, but uh, into the quantum moon. But I just got static, and it still disappeared. But wait, I, I didn't try. I have a thing I haven't tried yet. Did I try to send a probe into it, take a picture, have the static, and then just try and land on the moon? I think I didn't try that yet. I'm gonna have to try that next time. Look at the shadow on the planet from my <laughs> from my spaceship. That's awesome. Oh my god, this is so weird. Whoa, here we go. Holy sh man, this this view is sick when you come through the clouds. You come from quite oh. Is there someone sitting there? Let's land here. We found an island. Well, as slick as a greased wheel. Perfect landing. Nope! We don't want to return the suit, we want to equip the suit. Unidentified signal. 50 meters. <gasps> Is that Gabro? He was on Giant's Deep. It's gotta be him. Wait, is there actually a person on every planet? It just occurred to me. We are receiving music from every planet, right? So there's one guy we can talk to on every planet. Here we go. Gabro. Man, you're just chilling. Are you chilling here? Nice, it's you. Good to see you made it here in one piece. The first solo launch is a doozy, isn't it? So hey, uh, don't freak out or anything, but lately I keep, like, dying repeatedly? I don't know, it's pretty weird. Wait, what? What about you? Have you died lately, or is it just me? No, it's me too. We're in a time loop. Time has been behaving unusually lately. Yeah, a time loop makes sense. Cool. You're taking this pretty well. 
Huh, right back at you. Personally, I... What is this sound? Personally, I like new experiences, and I've never... What the fuck is going on? We're in space! Gabro! Hello? You float. <laughs> what the fuck's going on? Where are we? Did we get teleported? No, that's that's Giants Deep. It's right there. Oh, we're falling down. Oh my god, here we go. Whatever. I have stopped questioning the things that are happening before my eyes. I am just taking things as they come at this point. The tornadoes are moving. Did we just get launched by a tornado? Have you ever watched a cyclone for so long it started to hypnotize you? Oh, cyclones, that's what they are. I'm telling you, they'll put you in a trance if you stare at them long enough. Hmm. Is this like a... A hint? That I should try and look at them? Maybe take a picture of them? How's space treating you? So... I can't believe we just casually continue our conversation after being launched into space. The whole island. What's up with this planet? Ha! Huh. I know, right? Oh, you meant like, to tell you more about it? Gotcha. Well, uh, Giant's Deep is massive, and mostly water. No surprises there. There's a strong current, a waste beneath the surface that prevents anything from sinking below it. Seriously, I tried everything I could think of to get past that current, and neither idea worked. <laughs> so you thought of two things, that's great. As for land mass, masses, I've counted four islands, including this one. There's also the one with the Nomai statue I saw on the beach. Right, he went here to study the statues, right? That was his purpose. You've seen the cyclones? Yeah, they're hard to miss. They'll toss up everything in their path, islands included. R right. Little tip, if you get picked up, try to land in water. Less likely to kill you. Thanks. Um, what are you doing out here? Well, what are any of us doing here, really? Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm out here exploring our solar system, same as you. So why is this guy in a time loop like me? Seems like we're the only ones, then. This is the first one I've met that ex is experiencing the same thing that I'm experiencing. But I tell you what. Outer space really gives you room to think. It's quiet and peaceful out here. Not really. Not where you are, man. I mean, it's usually quiet and peaceful. Sometimes a cyclone comes by and lifts my little island paradise clean out of the water. Then, less peaceful. Yeah, I'd say so. Um, where's your ship? That's a good question. It's definitely on this planet somewhere. I mean, unless a cyclone came by and tossed it into space, I guess. <laughs> that would be pretty nuts. I hope it's not lonely. Okay. Um, where should I explore on Giant's Deep? Here's something you might like. At the start of every time loop, I keep seeing a bright flash in the sky. Something must be happening up there in orbit around the planet. What else? What else? Have you been to Statue Island? That's what I've been calling it, seeing as it's the island where I found the glowing Nomai statue. Get it? I was on the beach on Statue Island when the whole glowy business happened. By the way, it's a nice beach for that kind of thing. I give it a solid 7 out of 10 on the Gabbro relaxation scale. I was on the beach on Statue Island when the whole glowy business happened? If you feel like checking out Statue Island, it's the one with two islands connected by a natural rock arch. Well, mostly connected anyway, you'll see. Uh... So, I have a crazy theory about these statues, but I'm not gonna reveal it yet, because I need some, in some key piece of information first. I'm still building it. Uh, take it easy out there. 
Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll try in this environment. And we have ghost matter too. God, man. Yeah, that's not that's no good. Um, God, this place is making me anxious. I get nervous from these sounds. Oh my! God. Oh my! Oh, here we go! Here we go! Here we go! Shit is happening again. Oh man, we're in space. <gasps> the moon. Land in water. Uh, I mean, we were fine last time. I mean, it's, does it really matter if we get launched into space? Okay, we're back. Refuel jetpack. I just noticed the gravity is 1.8x, 2x right now. 2.2? What's happening? Uh... The gravity is about twice, I assume, Timber Hearth. That's the reference scale here, right? That's uh, I think that's the biggest gravity we've encountered yet. Uh, I can doze off. I don't want to do that. I'm getting some stutter again. I mean, sure, I'll roast the marshmallow in this hellhole. Make a nice golden brown. Marshmallow. Beautiful. All right. So can I go up there? Whoops. What did I just hit? Oh, wow. The gravity is really strong. I can't even uh, get five feet off the ground, man. Look at this view. Look at the curvature. It's actually such a cool thing about this game. The planets are so small, you actually see the curvature from the ground. Man, are you just sitting here chilling, huh? Playing your flute. Wait, wait. I think I could say something else. Uh... I found something. Nice, nice. What you got for me? I found what happened to the orbital probe cannon. Whoa, that's the cannon breaking apart at the start of each time loop? For real? Did you figure out why? Over enthusiasm. Uh, I don't even know what that means. Too much power? It's kind of scary how much that sounds like something Slate or Feldspar would do. I'm pretty surprised the Gnome I built something that actually broke. Huh. Come to think of it, come, come to think of it though, broke might be the wrong word. Because it looks like the orbital probe cannon is still firing successfully at the beginning of each time loop. I mean, yeah. But it's, it's, it, it breaks after that. That's not very useful. I found something. I found a photo of you inside the old radio tower, did I? Nice. Did I look busy in it? I hope I look busy. Must have been from the time Hornfell sent me to check on the deep space satellite. They thought all spacey might be malfunctioning, but I couldn't find a single thing wrong with it. Which is probably how it got, sh how it got a shot of my beautiful be-helmeted face, come to think of it. I always thought it was kind of sweet that the best way to find old spacey is to use a map that's generated by the satellite itself, isn't it? Like it's inviting us to visit. Good old deep space satellite. Always making sure we know where we're going. Uh, I remember that actually now. One of the maps in that place had uh, someone on it. Yeah, like a selfie. I didn't question it at the time that much. I was just like, ah, uh, these people are doing silly things type thing. Old spacey? I mean, the satellite's not super old, but it's hardly brand new. All is more of a term of term of affection. You're being very little-minded about this. Old Spacey likes visitors, you know? Fastest way to find it is to jump into your ship and use your solar system map to lock on to our faithful satellite friend, same as you would any astral body. 
Okay. Maybe I will. Uh, actually, never mind. Okay. So the best way to find that satellite is to look at the maps. I remember looking at the maps, not quite understanding what I was seeing. I mean, I'm un I did understand what I was seeing, but there was some mystery going on, according to the writing in that place, that I did not understand uh, why it was a mystery. Okay. Uh, let's take off. Go somewhere else. Whoops. Oh, I just had an idea. We can get to the top of this island with the with the ship, right? We can't do it with jetpack. Oh no. Oh fuck. We almost fell into a cyclone. We don't want to do that. Oh, here we go! <laughs> the island is gone. Here's another island. Okay, one goes up, one comes down. Whoa, don't fall into it now. <gasps> is this the... Yeah, that's it. This is the thing I saw in the projection. Whoops. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm yourself. Calm yourself. Land, land, land. Good. Nice. As slick. As smooth as a silk scarf, I would say. Very, very nice. Let's open the hatch. Also, uh, I, I think I'm pretty much uh, sure now. The star explodes whenever this music happens. As soon as this song is done, the star is going to explode. Got cyclones. Whoops. This is it. We finished building the final orbital probe cannon module and are ready to send it into orbit around Giant's Deep for assembly. Our next step will be to send privets up to the orbital probe cannon to install the probe tracking system. Here goes the sun. To all my friends here at the construction yard, my gratitude for your tireless work. I had given up hope, but I truly believe this cannon may actually succeed where many other attempts have not. Okay, take me. I'm ready. I'll be back for this. I'll be back. Oh my god. It's actually... Uh Oh, such a cool detail. When the sun explodes, it starts by contracting first, right? So, it's no longer as big, sending out as much light. So everything becomes dark for a brief moment. Until the supernova catches up. Very cool. Very cool. Also, I'm just noticing, the cannon is supposed to fire randomly, right? I have noticed that it's shooting in random directions, actually, every time the loop starts. Because at one time, the cannon shot the, the probe right through Giant's Deep, actually. Do you remember that? Um, no clue which episode that happened in, but I, I distinctly remember that. Just amazing. What a game. What a game. Anyway, that's gonna be it for me for now. I um, have a bunch of stuff to do today. Uh, so I'll probably get back to this game tomorrow. Maybe the day after tomorrow. But I can't wait. And I'll see you then. Goodbye. <laughs>